second in the NCAA 10,000. How are you feeling about that? It's surreal. I mean, I had goals to be at least first team All-American coming off of regionals. I was in ninth with about 500 to go, but there was just this glob of single file guys right in front of me. Kind of just went for it, and I had it, and so it was good. I mean, dream come true. The Hayward Field, everything, it's just magical. Yeah. I mean, what, what was that lost, lost lap like? You were just mowing that. <sighs> I don't even know. I just I went to the arms and just kind of was like, holy crap. Like, I couldn't believe it, so it just was, it was giving me this energy, and I just... I had it, so I mean, I knew I had one of the better wheels uh, coming in. I qualified for the regional meet in the 1500, so I knew I was one of the few guys that had done that. And I knew that if I was in position and feeling okay, I would pass some people, but wouldn't have thought seven in the last 500. So more than I could have asked for. I'm really happy with it. I mean, do you have any regrets not being closer to lead? <sighs> yes, but I probably would have had to have expended a lot more energy in the middle of the fight because, man, those guys were, it was a choppy race. Everybody's throwing elbows, everybody's break. Oop, you're getting bumped in and out. So, I mean, I think I expect, I saved enough energy so I could do that. If I would have fought to be closer, who knows if I would have had the same gear. And so I can't have any regrets. Uh, I exceeded my own expectations, so I'm happy with it. Yeah, but you had to be, I mean, that kind of race with it being slow until about the final mile, that had to play right into the hands. I thought that that was my best scenario if I felt good. And I couldn't even tell if I felt good or not. I mean, the laps were coming to me, and I wasn't, I mean, you kind of just go, okay, one more lap. Let's see what happens. One more lap, stay with these guys. And eventually it was 400 to go, and at that point, I think uh, you can always run a fast 400, so yeah. With about 100 to go, you were sort of closing. Scott a little bit like did you think that was a I was locking up a little bit and uh, I don't know it was the exact same thing that happened at regionals I mean what if but no I I knew he had me with about 70 80 to go I kept with the arms just hoping maybe he'd break but he's a world-class runner and can't expect that from him yeah first year doing the 10 is my third 10k but yeah I mean I don't think I'll change. I think I'll stick with it. Uh, yeah, so I'm a sophomore. Two more years of this. Hopefully, considering he's graduating, I'll be top returner. I'd love to come back here and get a win next year. So, Have you done a mission, or do you have plans to do a mission? Uh, no plans, and have not, no. Yeah. 20 years old, I'm the baby of the team. <laughs> so, yeah. Hey, thanks. Hey, thank you so much.